All right, guys, so here's an update on how far we've gotten. We got the handlebar set up. We got the cluster exactly where I want it. We got the, we got the throttle, housing, and uh, front brake all set up. So that's good to go. I am gonna adjust the bars up a little bit just because I feel like it would be more comfortable for me for them to be up a little bit. Right now I got the key switch here, but that's gonna change after I do the, air, the clean air mod. Today, I think what we're gonna attack is we're going to take the tail off and see how we're gonna install this 12 bar on there because if, I, if I'm doing a, a wheelie and I end up 12 o'clock and wave past the 12 o'clock and in wreck, it's gonna stop it from damaging my bike. So that's one thing I'm gonna work on and hopefully I can get that done. But yeah, man, she's looking good. We got the headlight to do yet. We got a couple little projects, but I'm enjoying the process. I'm gonna build this slow. I'm gonna build it at my pace and get it done right. But look at that, she looks beautiful, man. I'll tell you what, just what I imagined, just what I dreamed of when I started uh, thinking about this mission and about how I wanted to build my dream stunt bike. And so far, man, I'm just in awe, I'm in love. So we're gonna continue pushing, we're gonna get it done. Let's go. Let's go. What I'm left it with is I removed the tail fairing. I believe the 12 bar is going to go on this part here at the bottom of the frame. So what I have to probably cut this off so the tail lights off. I could put my 12 bar on and possibly my fairing back on, which that's also going to have to be customized. But that's kind of what I'm leaning towards. Um, I have to do some research, but I think that's where we're gonna leave it off at. And then we're gonna move on to me actually tearing it down after I do my research. Now I'm gonna actually set this up. I bought 12 bar here. Let's see exactly how this is gonna go. All right, so looks like am I going here? Am I going? I'm gonna have to do some research. Alrighty, ladies and gents, to be able to put the 12 bar on this thing, I have to cut out these two knobs here on the tail, on the subframe. So let's go. <laughs> try me, try me. I think that's where we at, baby. Alrighty guys, so I believe I have it in the right place. I'm just gonna have to drill the holes now. Drill out one side first and then the other. And I think I'm going to be able to put the tail fairing back on. Might have to do some adjustments to that. But overall, I think we're looking pretty sweet. If I could keep it as freaking factory as possible. It's gonna be sick, dude. All right, let's get this hole drilled, y'all. Let's go. Alrighty, Auto Tool fam. When you install your bolts, if you want to rock this under tail piece, you're going to have to drill out the plastic like I did here to be able to install it. But look at that. That's going to be sweet, man. I'm going to put the, ta the tail fairing on it right now. But I think when I'm when I start practicing, I'm not gonna have it on because if I go all the way back and loop it, I don't want it to break the fairing. But yeah, let's go. Damn. Let's go. What y'all think, man? We did it, yo. Put that back piece on. Now we just have to do the clean air mod. Do the wire tuck. What else do I need to do? I think we're almost done, man. Only a couple more things. Let's go. 